What's up everybody, Typical Gamer here, and today I'm here on Typical Reviews. Guys, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button real quick. This is gonna be a great video. Rockstar Games, my favorite gaming company in the world. Um, when I went over to New York to go play with uh, Dead Mouse, Richard Sherman, and uh, Carl Anthony Towns, well, I played with him last time, but he was there. And I uh, actually went to the YouTube Creator Summit, and Rockstar's like, hey, why don't you come over? We'll give you something cool, and uh, we wanna meet you, so I, how could I say no? How could I say no? Rockstar freaking games, creators of GTA 5, Red Dead Redemption, and all the games you love basically. All the games I played growing up and all that. So I went over and they gave me this mystery bag of stuff and I'm gonna reveal to you what's in it. If you are a GTA 5 fan, this is what is in here. And uh, it's gonna be some great stuff, I guarantee you. I looked through a bit of it and it, it is really, really sweet. So I'm super, super excited. And there is uh, there's a lot of stuff in there. There is a lot of stuff. So let's get right into it. We're gonna pull the first thing out over here. And over here we got, boys, we got the Sprunk Extreme, the essence of life water bottle. Look at this thing, Sprunk, of course, from GTA 5. And uh, now I've got a water bottle of it. Pretty freaking cool. I would have to say, this is awesome. And I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's BPA free. All right, it's, it is BPA free. It's squeezable, environmentally friendly, and uh, pure. Stay, stay lean, stain free. Oh my gosh. Taste your water, not your bottle. Great stuff. Okay, so now we're moving forward over here. And uh, you know, there's a lot of clothes and stuff. We're gonna pull out one of the first items over here. But I just wanna mention the bag here, really sweet Rockstar logo. I've never seen this bag before in my life. And, uh, and this hat either. Here we got a Rockstar beanie by New Era, and it has the Rockstar logo here, and uh, you got the New Era logo over here, and it looks pretty stylish, pretty sleek. I'm gonna be wearing this as a Canadian. Uh, it does get cold in here for like 12 months out of 12. No, I'm just kidding. It's more like eight months, six, half the year at least is freezing cold in Toronto, and uh, this thing will keep my head warm, but it is my favorite game company on it, so sweet. Let's put that away, boom. Oh man, okay, I'm not gonna pull that out yet. I'm not gonna pull that out yet. Should I? <sighs> Clothes or accessories? Which one should I pull out first? Um, okay, we're gonna pull out. <sighs> no, this is so hard. Okay, okay, this. I wanna show you this. As you can see, GTA 5 logo on the top, and then you got the Meriwether Security. I actually had this item before. I did break it. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, it got crushed a little bit. My bad. At the travel here, okay? Um, let's pull this out, and I had this before, I did break it, and it is super, super cool. Maybe I'll put the demonstration of what it does additionally for you guys, but uh, let's take this thing out. Imagine I break it again, that would be traumatizing. I don't think I could live with myself. Oh, look, an unboxing right here, boom. Eh, get through there, boom. You got the Meriwether Security Cup with the Rockstar logo on the bottom over here. Very stylish cup, very good looking and uh, great for your coffee. It has one secret trick to it. When there's hot liquid inside, it changes the appearance of it and it shows something special. I believe over here and over here. So I'm gonna have a demonstration for you guys. Use the power of editing to put it in the video and uh, you guys definitely gonna love it. It's sweet. Here we go with the Meriwether security mug. So you guys are gonna see the cool thing that happens when something hot goes inside of it. So let's get this Kirk started and let's start making some coffee. Okay, the machine just finished dispensing the coffee. It's still kind of filling it up to the top. So as you can see, it's slowly turning white. But if we turn it over, the side that had absolutely nothing on it now has something as it slowly heats up to the top. Alrighty, so on to the next item here. We have, boom, we have the, uh, see Dr. Freelanda. You have the stress ball over here. I. Probably broke the packaging like that, but that's okay. Dr. Freelander stress ball, boom. And um, what does it say over here? For relief of anger issues, audition anxiety disorder, high conflict divorces, stress disorder, alien hand syndrome, neediness, emptiness, and lack of emptiness. So basically this is for everything. All of your problems can be solved with this. Uh, we're gonna open it up. I already have one of these. 
so that's why I'm opening up, or else I'd keep it for like collector's stuff. Uh, embracing the ego by murdering the super ego. Dr. Isaiah? Isaiah? I, I'm not sure if, it's hard to read, it's in cursive. But uh, as you can see, get the anger out, or additionally you could throw it at people like Billy back there. I hit him. <laughs> Did that hurt? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. So uh, moving through here. I gotta show you this, but we're gonna keep this it's made in China. Maybe we don't show that. <laughs> we're, I'm gonna keep this towards the end though. Keep an eye on this though. Can you guess what it is? I can. Okay, so we're gonna work through. Um, oh wow. Okay, found a couple more stuff. We're gonna work through the t-shirts real quick. And boys, there are a lot of them. Um, a ma I'm gonna be 100% honest. A major reason why I want to do the unboxing like as soon as possible is so I can wear these shirts. I'm actually gonna put one of these on for the live stream that I'm doing like right now. So, boom, they're all medium size because they're like, yo, Dre, what's your size? They didn't call me Dre. I think they called me Typical Gamer or Andre. Probably Andre. But uh, they asked me, and you'll see right here. Let me get a proper, proper station here. As you can see, it says Los Santos, and this is Andreas. So really cool, Los Santos San Andreas. All in one, super cool. Again, this I think San Andreas, I don't think they ever like completely state it, but San Andreas is like the state, Los Santos is sort of like the city. So really cool shirt, <laughs> I dig it. I'm gonna wear that. And uh, I'm just gonna put them off to the side because uh, it's been a long time since I worked in retail and my folding abilities aren't up to par. And uh, this one is super cool. This one's gonna go along with something else I'm gonna show you guys. Straight up just Los Santos in that, uh, what, what kind of writing is this? Do you know what kind of writing this is really? Gothic? Gothic, but kind of usually used in a gangster. Yeah, gangster, sorry. Yeah, see, I like his. It, it's sort of, yeah, yeah, I feel you. And we got the Rockstar tag up here. Guys, these shirts are freaking awesome. Rockstar, I love you guys. Much love from, from typical gamer Team TG out here. And uh, you got the Rockstar logo at the back as well. Let's just get that in for the camera over here. You see, I don't know where this camera's pointed. We got to figure this out, but boom. Hopefully, you guys can see that Rockstar logo on the back, Rockstar logo on the front and the Los Santos on the front as well. Moving through, we got a classic here, all right? And just tell you, this is a dream come true, and a lot of you love this as well. Boy, do I love this. This is, like, I've been playing Grand Theft Auto forever, guys. Like, real real talk, real quick. And just, like, to get the developers of the game and the people behind it to, like, actually recognize you and sort of, like, give you stuff, it's hype. It's hype. That's the first word that came to mind. It's hype. GTA 5 logo right here. Boom. Rockstar logo on the back. That's going to be a common trend throughout all of them, I feel. But uh, let me show you guys right here. Boom. The infamous 5 logo. Boom, baby. Fantastic. All right. Next up, we got a baseball tee. And it says uh, Rockstar Games. I have to read it real quick, so I'm not sure exactly what it said. But it does say Rockstar Games in a cool sort of stylish font. It's a little different from their logo, but um, it does look super, super cool. I know I've said super cool like eight times. That's cool, though. That's cool, though. Saying super cool is cool. All right, here we got the Rockstar Games logo, and it seems to be like sort of like a industrial vibe to it. You got some people. Is this guy killing that person? It sort of looks like that person's mounted another person. I see a dinosaur here. It's very, um, I don't know what to call it. It's very, it's cool, I dig it. It's very unique though. Is this, is this medium? Yeah, these are, these are getting quite large for medium. <laughs> Doesn't this look big for a medium? Am I crazy? Billy, am I crazy? No. It looks quite large. Like I, I think I have decently sized soldiers. These are like big old broad shoulders. They have XL shoulders over here. But pretty cool shirt. Boom, baby. And let's move through over here. You guys are gonna like this. Games, gamers, we play. I play GTA 5 on PC mostly now. Got two mouse pads. Got the Life Invader mouse pad. Go dock yourself. <laughs> I love your Rockstar. Then we got, oh, oh gosh. We got the iFruit one, which is of course the in game um, iPhone. If you didn't know that, if you didn't put the pieces together, Apple, iFruit. And uh, just to give you guys a view from the top down over here, it looks great. And the Life Invader one as well. Let me know if you guys want, like, because I have these mouse pads already. And if I have any duplicates, I might be doing a giveaway. So if you guys want to know about the giveaway, check out the social media stuff in the description. And also be sure to subscribe, the best way to do it. And let me know if you guys want to see a giveaway. I'm not saying that there will be 100%, but uh, I do have duplicates. And I think it would be pretty cool to give back to you guys who are mega fans of the series as well. 
So, go in here. I'm gonna keep the, the two things in here so for second last, all right? Here we got the uh, the Mr. Robot over here. I don't think he's called Mr. Robot. The loneliest robot, and it's from the in-game movie. This is actually, I'm gonna pull it out and show you guys, because again, I actually have this one as well. And I'm gonna pull out and show you guys, this is actually, Billy, do you know what it is? I have an idea, but let's see if people figure it out. Okay, let's see. Well, it's hard to always guess like, oh, comment and guess what it is, because I'm about to show you. And then you can say, oh, I got it, man. I'm so good at this guessing thing. Be honest with yourself, all right? All right, here. You got the loneliest robot, and boom. Is that the right guess, Billy? Mm -hmm. All right, it's a USB stick. Boom, you, you, store, you store all your good stuff on this one because nobody's gonna be checking Mr. Robot. And you got the Rockstar lo logo over here, Grand Theft Auto logo over here, and of course, the robot with the arms, the functionality of the arms, it's great beat stuff up. Okay. Lonely S Robot, we're putting you back in the box. It's been a while since I watched the movie that, oh shoot. I don't know if the movie's, like the in-game movie, I don't know how to do this. We're putting this down. Uh, I don't know if the in-game movie's based on anything, like a real story or anything. It's, uh, you know, at the beginning of the game, it's like, not based off anything, but you know, it might be low-key based on something. All right. Guys. You know me, when you look at me, when you think typical gamer, you think, dude's wearing a hoodie, he's wearing glasses, and he's got a hat on. Boys, they gave me two hats. This happened. This happened, they gave me two hats. They gave me the Rockstar hat. I didn't know this existed, this is super cool. This is actually from FlexFit. And they, and it says Rockstar on the back, actually. Which is pretty cool. I'm trying to get the top down angles as well. Boom, I've never heard of this brand, but, you know, they know I have a large head, so they give me a large, and uh, we're we're gonna we're gonna check it out. We're gonna see if it's cool. And then, boys, they gave me a new one. They gave me a new Low Santos hat. Billy, can you grab the other one right there? It's right there. It's right there, by my desk, near near the 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 gold play button. Thank you guys very much. And I just want to show you guys how often I've used this thing, because uh, we're gonna do a little comparison here. This is. The old one that I've been using for three years now, almost three years, versus a new one. Wow. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? That is wear and tear to the max. That is That just shows how often I use it. Let's get the top down view as well. Oh my gosh, I don't even know if I should, I should just keep using the old one. I need a lint roller on this thing apparently. <laughs> but uh, super dope hat. Oh man, I'm so happy that they gave me this. They don't even know, man. They don't even know how happy they made me by giving me this stuff. Shout out again to Rockstar. Great, great guys over there. So, really cool. Thank you so much for the hat. Boom. I'm gonna be wearing that on stream, boys. I'm gonna be wearing that on stream. And I forgot, there's one more thing in here that I forgot about because it's so small. I actually have this attached to my keys, so you can assume by now it is a keychain. And uh, there is your keychain thing over there. It is the monkey, the pogo, actually. For those of you going, typical gamer doesn't know it's pogo. I know it's pogo. All right, let me show you the top one as well. This is pogo, down, down, down we go. As you can see, little pogo here. Um, some might know him by the Louis Caliber head. Louis, if you're watching this, love you, bro. Yeah, so super sweet. I have this on my uh, keychain as well, and uh, really, really cool. Love it. Okay. So the big ticket item here, they're all big ticket items first and foremost, but um, the one I really wanted, I was at Swifter's house trying out VR stuff, which is the future by the way, and uh, I saw this on his fridge. And the moment I saw it, I said I want it. I tweeted it, some of you might know it. Pull this out. Do you have any clue what it is now? It's an egg timer. It's an egg timer. It's a very unique egg timer. Why? It looks like a freaking vault twisty knob thing. What are they called? Vault knob. You have no idea either. Combination <laughs> lock. Combination lock. There we go. And look at this thing. The great thing about this thing is it literally turns anything into a safe. If you have a metal fridge, you put this on the metal fridge, pa, and guess what? It looks like a vault. It looks like a vault. It's sweet. And I guess it does have an egg timer function as well. Sounds like the vault's gonna explode, basically, but let's get to it. 
There you go. That's cool. I didn't, I didn't, wait, hit it again. There we go, cool. So this is definitely one of my favorite things. I knew I had to have it. When they gave me the bag, I'm like, uh, I, I don't think I sound like this, but not to sound ungrateful, but you guys also have that egg timer thing because that thing is sweet. And we're gonna show you a shot of how it looks on the fridge just to show you guys how freaking cool it looks on the fridge. But this thing looks freaking cool on the fridge. And here we go with the Rockstar Grand Theft Auto 5 little vault combination lock over here, egg timer. Fortunately, it doesn't go on the front of the fridge. Uh, the front is not really well magnetized, but the side is. But hopefully yours will actually make it look like your fridge is a safe, you know, safeguarding all that delicious and yummy food in it. And it doubles as an egg timer, so let's hear that little ring for it. That'll be 10 minutes, but I don't want to wait, make you guys wait 10 minutes. So here we go. And there you have it, the Rockstar Combination Egg Timer. Yeah, so that's about it for this video. Again, thank you guys for being so awesome and all support on this channel. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more videos unboxing from like stuff that game companies give us, uh, be sure to let me know. Like, drop a thumbs up on the video. That is the best way to let us know. If you think this is cool, drop a thumbs up. You may think just your support is nothing, but it's literally like you times a couple of thousand of people that can make all the difference in, um, in, in letting us know, really. So drop that thumbs up, share this video with a friend that you think would find it super cool, and uh, subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos just like this, guys. Everything else you need to know will be linked in the description below. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day, and peace out.